I'm joined on the phone by Mr. Qada Razuki. He is from the Stop the Gaza Slaughter. He's joining us from London on the phone. Mr. Razuki, tell us how you feel about all this. What's your reaction to what's been happening in Gaza? Well, it's Ms. Razuki, um, first of all. Um, and just in terms of not just my reaction, but today, 20 hours notice, thousands of people demonstrated and really broke through police barriers uh, outside the Israeli embassy in London, people, feelings are running very, very high as to what Israel is doing yet again in Palestine and obviously especially in Gaza. But I just want to say to people that are listening, in England today, we've had demonstrations in Scotland, Manchester, London, and we will keep demonstrating until our government, who have kept quiet on this, and until the Israelis stop the genocide that they're committing, what the Nazis did to the Israelis, the Israelis are doing to the Palestinians now, and they should be disgusted themselves. Ms. Razuki, how do you evaluate for us the role Egypt plays in amidst all this? Well, well, Egypt and the Egyptian government, not the Egyptian people, are complicit in this. They need to open their border. They need to open their border, not just to allow things in, but to allow Palestinians out as well but not just the Egyptian government. Every Arab government, apart from your country, has kept quiet over this. They are complicit in this. They're, they're happy to sit with George Bush, to sit with Gordon Brown, and to back up the Israelis to the health when the majority of the people in those countries do not support their government one bit. 